Hello friends, welcome to the Take Better Photos channel. From the very beginning, blurry photos has been a problem for shooters of all stripes. And if internet articles and posts are anything to go by, the problem has remained till this very day. It used to be the case if you had a blurry photo, the chances it could be fixed were not very high. However, in today's digital age, with the advent of AI, more and more tools are boasting of deblurring and sharpening technology using trained AI models to fix what was thought unfixable. In this video, we're going to pit three prominent deblurring sharpening tools and find out which one is truly the best. As usual, stick around till the end for the slideshow comparison and my verdict. But before we go into that, let's have a quick overview of the three entries. Let's start off with our first competitor, On1 TacSharp AI. TacSharp AI comes with On1 Photo Raw 2023, which as of this writing costs 80 US dollars. On1 claims TacSharp AI comes with state-of-the-art deblurring that can detect motion and camera blur and then reduce it to make your photo tack sharp. To use it, just navigate to the noise and sharpening section and click the Tack Sharp AI tab. That's it. A split view comes up which allows you to compare before and after. Tack Sharp AI comes with two sliders, but by default, the deblur slider is normally set to maximum, so what is previewed is really the best you can get. The second competitor is Luminar Neo Super Sharp AI which claims it can make your photos naturally crisp. As of this writing, Luminar Neo costs 199 US dollars, which includes the basic Luminar Neo and all seven extensions, including Super Sharp AI. If you just want the Super Sharp plugin, that costs 50 US dollars. So to use Super Sharp AI, you have to install the plugin then you have to navigate to the Super Sharp AI section where you can choose between universal and motion blur models and select low, medium, or high. I find motion blur in general gives the more prominent results whether the blur was caused by motion or something else. The third competitor is Topaz Labs Sharpen AI. The company claims their product produces jaw-dropping results, which can sharpen images with no artifacts. Sharpen AI costs $80. The main benefits of Sharpen AI include the following. It allows you to batch process multiple images at once. You can choose from more models, motion blur, out of focus, and soft. It has more ways to compare. You can use split view, mirror, and single view. So now that we have a better idea of which are the competitors, let's look at the slideshow comparison. And at the end, I'll give my verdict on which one is the best.
So I hope you enjoyed that slideshow comparison. I tried my best to choose photos where the difference can actually be seen. It's quite tricky when you're comparing sharpening results. So which was the winner? Well, if you could not detect it from the slideshow comparison, to my eyes, the clear winner and winning by a landslide was Topaz Labs Sharpen AI. Across all my test images, whether it be blurring caused by motion, out of focus, or just a soft image, the improvement for Topaz Labs AI was the most noticeable. And their characterization that it's jaw-dropping is not far off at all. I would say some of the results were indeed jaw-dropping. So for example, in this image, this is the original image here, very soft, as you can see. But with Topaz Labs AI, you can see how much sharpening it has produced, right? This is the original, and this is Topaz Labs Sharpen AI. None of the other competitors were able to match the kind of sharpness it produces. The same goes for its sharpening for motion blur. You can see that Topaz Labs AI was the only one who could really sharpen it realistically. Right, same goes for this image here. This is the original image. And again, Topaz Labs Sharpen AI just sharpens it quite naturally. And it's very prominent sharpening. You can really see a difference. So Topaz Sharpen AI was the winner. But who would I give second place to? I would say second place would go to Luminar Neo Super Sharp AI. Their face enhancer does work in recovering faces. And in general, its improvement was much more prominent than on one. So for example, in this extremely blurred photo, you could see that Luminar Neo was able to sharpen this very close to the way Topaz Labs was able to do it. So I would say their face enhanced technology does give an extra boost to the sharpening results. And I discussed this face enhanced technology in a separate video. Its motion blur technology is also good. This is the original and this is Luminar Neo Super Sharp AI. You can see at least that there is some improvement uh, in the sharpening. Okay, same thing for this, for this image here. This is the original and this is Luminar Neo. Now in third place is On1 Tech Sharp AI. On1 Tech Sharp AI had the fastest processing and the easiest operation. So there was not much lag when you were using On1 Tech Sharp AI. It was almost instantaneous. But the main issue I had with On1 is the lack of any visible improvement in most of the images here. So once again, going back to the original image, this is the original image and this is On1's result. Okay, there is some sharpening, but very, very minimal. This is the original and On1. Original On1. I would say On1 sharpening works best on static objects like buildings or monuments. So I find that On1 did its best work in images like this. Well, here is the original and this is On1's result. So you can see the sharpening here was more distinctive. But when it comes to faces, I find this technology did barely anything. So there you have it. I hope you found this video helpful. Tell me what you think. Which is your favorite deblurring tool? Write it down in the comments. And if you like this content, don't forget to help the videos coming by liking, subscribing, and sharing. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.